I just started using them. I had my son <laughs> set me up on Facebook and then LinkedIn I'm just starting to do it myself. I'm recently unemployed so I did that for networking. I see a lot of my friends starting to use it and I think I should probably get with it and get started on it pretty soon. Not just for throwing virtual sheep and chatting about American Idol, the number of baby boomers hopping on the social media wagon has reached a record high, jumping 59% since last year. And if you're looking for a job in a dicey economy, Brian Johnson says it's crucial to follow the action. The people who are hiring are definitely on social networks, and that's the big difference. You want to be around the people who are hiring. Johnson runs Internet Guide Services and helps people navigate the often confusing waters of the web. What I do is I hold their hand and walk them into this social networking space and show them that their friends are already there. Well, first thing is you're going to decide... Today he's meeting with Renee Shimada Siegel. Her business connects high-tech firms with PR and marketing consultants. With Johnson's guidance, Siegel is managing her profiles on LinkedIn, Facebook and Twitter more effectively. You can share it on Twitter yeah, and email you can or post Facebook. it to Facebook right there. So this is an article ah, that I like, I want to share it. Excellent. And decide which one it is that you're actually going to The first thing to keep in mind, it's not what you know, it's who you know. Boomers know networking is important. What they may not realize is whether they're in the market for a job or not. It's essential they own their contacts. A good friend of mine worked at a large international finance company for nine years. She had accumulated thousands of business contacts. When she was laid off, it didn't occur to her that that was the most important part of her job that she needed to carry forward into her job search. To avoid rebuilding your network from scratch, Johnson recommends setting up your work and personal address books to sync automatically. Next, sign up. There are lots of sites to choose from, but start with LinkedIn, Plaxo, FriendFeed, and Facebook. Then, add information to your profiles that showcases your talent and experience. You need to show how you can help other people make money in their business. What's important is help people understand what you can do to help them out right now. So it's not about what you've done, it's about what you can do. Now for some do's and don'ts. Don't use your profile as a soapbox for political and religious views. Do update your status daily to remain front and center with your contacts, but avoid frivolous posts. Today I had tacos for lunch. That could be a status update. Or you could say, read a terrific article in the Harvard Business Review last night. Here's a link to the story. Which type of status update is your best foot forward? Once your profile is up, monitor it regularly. Any sort of makeover starts and finishes with a look in the mirror. So the first thing you need to do is take a look at what you look like online. Try Googling yourself. Make sure you're easy to find. How would you come across to a complete stranger? One way to develop a positive online reputation is through references. I advise my clients to write a recommendation for someone every week and you're increasing the likelihood many times that someone's going to return the favor. I think of this as paying it forward. But can sites like LinkedIn really help you get ahead? Renee Siegel has no doubt. It's been a really great way just to stay in front of our clients, maybe ask them a quick question. Boomers may resist initially, but Johnson is certain the social networking scene can help them put their best professional foot forward online. I really didn't want to share my contacts with everyone else out there, but Brian helped me to understand that there really is a true business benefit for staying visible and managing our contacts in the correct way. For MoneyWatch.com, Excellent, I can do this. I'm Sumi Das.